the NFL has a serious problem. And maybe it's not the whole NFL. But definitely these two teams have a serious problem, and it's ruining, in my opinion, the integrity of the game. And the most egregious of the two is going to be the Buccaneers, so let's take a look, huh? Because as of right now during this game, they are down by 8. Yes, Baker just threw an interception, and the Lions are attempting to kneel it out. The only problem is, as they take a knee on third down, there is still a timeout left for the Bucs, meaning they could call it, force a field goal, and get the ball back. Which they should do, every single time. But instead... They just let the clock run down to zero, and the game just ends. A playoff game. They literally just gave up in. And I mean, did you not watch the Packers game the day prior? What about the Bills game the week prior with the missed 29-yard field goal? People miss kicks, and the Lions kicker Badgley is only 82% in his career, which, as Tyler Bass, is not exactly automatic. Not only that, but you could also attempt to block it, they could muff the snap, anything could happen. But letting the clock run down down here is the most chicken sh thing I've ever seen, and it's just disrespectful for your players to not let them attempt to go win this game. However, it's also only one example of giving up this weekend. The other one comes in the Texans-Raven game, and yes, the Ravens were smacking around the Texans. Yes, they are down by 24 points when getting the ball back with a minute and 50 seconds left, so yes, winning here is extremely improbable, and maybe even borderline impossible. But it's the mother in divisional round. This is a moment, in my opinion, where you say to your analyst, don't tell me the odds, just give me the best plays to score quickly. High risk, schmy risk. There's nothing to lose. If you throw an interception, the game's over. So what? So you might as well go down swinging. But instead, they literally run the ball, throw a screen where the guy stays in bounds, run the ball again, and run a minute and 50 seconds off in three plays. My jaw was on the floor. Like, this is how you wanted to go out? Don't get me wrong. Three touchdowns. Nearly impossible. But at least try. Like, I don't care if you just run three go routes, sling and hail Marys, try to get the PI or chunk play, kick the onside, don't get it back, and lose like a man. I mean, look at the Cowboys. They were getting their shit shoved like a gay man getting lucky on the first date. But their backs against the wall, everything against them, and they were still swinging the ball trying to set up a drive and score, knowing the chances of them winning was extremely unlikely. Ultimately, tell me if I'm overreacting here, but I just cannot stand teams rolling over and dying in the playoffs. Maybe in a regular season game when you have a whole season ahead of you, but in the playoffs, hell no. This should have some major ramifications in the coaching staff, because that's just bad football.